This is James Bowman III again. Oh, we're working our way through this musical journey. We just started. Uh, our first track that we talked about was She's an Original. That's track number one. And of course, for those of you who are just joining us, uh, there is a uh, my third project releasing. God has allowed me to uh, uh, release. will be on June 13th this year. And so each week, uh, beginning on the 11th, of April, I'll be sharing a video, right, that discusses the song and just talks about where the inspiration came from. Short video clip. And so we're on track number two tonight. And track number two is entitled, Let Me Show You. So what is it about? Well, uh, my mother, God bless her, uh, had to get me out of the inner city. And so she sent me to Huntsville, Alabama to go to college. I ended up going to Uh, Oakwood University Uh, of course you know I had some challenges Uh, didn't do well in school initially and you know God began to work uh, had been working on me and during this time uh, I got to Oakwood well it was Oakwood College then I got there in 1981 and God saw fit that I was introduced to this young lady and uh, I (laughs) well she she I don't think she was as sure when she met me, I was the one. But I, I, even though I wasn't as godly as I should have been, uh, I, I always had uh, like an inkling, like a premonition, like, yeah, this is the one. And and it, despite both of us having some home challenges, you know, I, I just, I don't know, it was just in my spirit, I knew. And so I met this young lady and I tried, you know, things that guys do, we try to get their attention and, you know, Sometimes talking works, but we're, you know, we're young. We don't know what we're doing. And uh, so as we kind of moved along, uh, you know, God began to just show me, hey, listen, uh, there's a way you talk to a young lady. Uh, The word of God says that God is love. Uh, He is the embodiment of love. And so if you read God's word, if, if you try to emulate his character, uh, then, you know, you will ooze love. And, and also the word of God says, if I be lifted up, I will draw basically people to me. And that includes love. This is why for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. And so, so we must emulate the love of Christ. And, and listen, that love must be unconditional and that type of love my friends can only come from Jehovah because you know flesh will get in the way and cause you to want to retaliate Uh, I'm raising my hand because I'm chief among sinners Uh, you know you want to retaliate and verbally but but if, if God gives you that peace that passeth understanding and that love that loves unconditionally like I love you because God put us together and we may not always agree but I love you and I have to treat you with respect and this, this is, these are the things God uh, showed me along the way and, and, and as we've uh, gone on one of the fascinating things I've found about uh, being married when, when the Bible talks about uh, the Bible says a man and a woman became one is over the years you begin to actually think alike and it's uncanny Something simple like you'll bring home a pizza and she'll say, oh, I was just thinking about a pizza. Or she'll she'll say, hey, you like this? Or she'll make me a smoothie. I'm like, wow, I was just thinking about that. That's the oneness, the constant being around each other and, and at, at your best and at your worst and, and going through having children together and, and the pain. Children are sick and you're staying up all night. And it's, it's a lot. But, but when God begins to show us that love, that unconditional love, it gets sweeter as the years go by. And at some point, you actually feel lost <laughs> without your uh, without your mate because you, you've developed a bond. And, and so this track talks about, let me show you. It's basically God telling me, James, let me show you how to communicate with this young lady, how to talk with her uh, such that you can form a bond uh, that will last uh, until you are no longer. And uh, so anyway, uh, that's what this track is, is about. It's called Let Me Show You. 
It is track number two on our musical journey headed toward 10. Hope you like it. See you next time.